Broadcast booth. Gary. Hey, Tom. Thanks very much. Uh, a look back at yesterday briefly, uh, especially about the start of Chris Tillman. I mean, uh, the time I think Mike has passed for what we've heard so often from starters. Oh, I made a couple of mistakes. A couple of mistakes don't result in 16 runs. And the Orioles starters just, they're not getting it done. And for Chris yesterday, I mean, just a very shallow outing. Yeah, it's starting to get to the point when you're an offensive player going against this Orioles rotation, you're just looking up middle because the mistake's coming. I mean, it's happening time and time again. And I know, okay, you're making too many mistakes, but it's a consistent uh, event here every night, it seems. And that's what happened to Chris Tillman. The first two batters looked like he was on his ball game, But uh, then he started messing around a little bit. When he fell behind, the mistakes were coming, and they were getting hit hard. And when you make mistakes against this Yankees team, I mean, this is one, uh, one of the strongest offenses, the strongest right now in the American League, and it looks like they're just going to get stronger. And one of the things we were talking about, Mike, that happens for the ball club overall, when your starters are struggling this way, you get behind so early and so far that it's very tough to take those at bats. It is. Night after night it seems like this team is just stuck on the field. Uh, long innings, crooked numbers being put up and they try to overcome. Yeah, The Orioles are uh, known for their ability to come back and they've done a real nice job late in ball games this year but when it happens on a nightly basis it starts to wear on you and it seems like the uh, Orioles are getting to that point where it's a here we go again type game. So here we go with Kevin Gosman. I mean he's expected to be one of the stars of the staff he's pitched well at some point some not in others they really need him to come through here today well fortunately it seems like he's slowly starting to make the turn and it all comes back to execution with Gosman as well he's missed his spots but you know one thing he has in his corner and he hasn't gotten off to a great start against the Yankees he's had past success so maybe he can dig deep in there and understand what it took to actually have the successful numbers he had last season um, and overcome today he is the guy that's got to step up it's always next man up and he's the one that's got to get deep in the ball game and save this Oriole bullpen. All right. So we'll see what happens today for the Orioles. Obviously, an embarrassment yesterday. Those kind of game happen in baseball, but you really want to come back the next day and make a statement, and we'll see whether or not the O's can do that. Tom? 